Now buffer action of a buffer solution. So buffer action is ability of buffer solution to resist change in its pH on addition of small amount of acid or base to it. So what is buffer action? It is ability of buffer solution to resist change in its pH on addition of small amount of acid or base to it. Let us discuss the buffer action of acidic buffer. Let's say, let's take an example of acidic buffer of acetic acid and sodium acetate. So you know acetic acid is a weak acid. So weak acid dissociates to some extent. So ionized form and unionized form. They are in equilibrium. Sodium acetate is a strong electrolyte. It dissociates completely to give acetate ion and Na plus ion. Now see, there is a common ion and you know when there is a common ion at equilibrium, equilibrium shifts backward. So dissociation of weak acid is suppressed because of the presence of common ion. That is called common ion effect. Case 1. Add acid. Now we add acid in the acidic buffer, when we add acid, say HCl, when we add HCl, you know HCl is a strong acid, it gives H3O plus ion. So initially, due to the addition of HCl, there is an increase in H3O plus ion. So there should be decrease in pH. Because pH is minus log of H plus ions. Now, these H3O plus ion, when get into the solution, they react with already present acetate ions and we get acetic acid and H2O. So you know that H2O is a weak electrolyte, acetic acid is a weak acid, so it doesn't change pH of the solution because H3O plus ion added by the acid gets neutralized by the base present in the buffer solution. So acetate ion act as a base for the acid added and that's why there is no effect of adding small amount of acid in the buffer solution. Case 2. If we add base, when we add base, say NaOH, when we add NaOH, you know, NaOH again, it is a strong, now base, it gives Na plus ion and OH negative ion. So OH negative ion makes the solution more basic, means pH should increase due to the presence of OH negative ion, but 
when OH negative ions are added, H3O plus is in action and H3O plus ion already present in the buffer solution react with OH negative ion and give H2O liquid. In this way, we add H plus ions or OH negative ion buffer solution neutralize it. If we add base acid present in the solution act against it. If we add acid base present in the solution act against it. That means buffer solution has reserve acidity as well as basicity which counter attack on the acid or base if we add them in the buffer solution and in this way buffer solution resist the change in its pH. So this is the buffer action for the acidic buffer. Now let us take example of basic buffer. Buffer action of basic buffer. Basic buffer for example ammonium hydroxide plus ammonium chloride. You know ammonium hydroxide is a weak base. It gives NH4 plus and OH negative ions. NH4Cl is a strong electrolyte. It gives NH4 plus and Cl negative ions. Again there is a common ion and due to common ion effect dissociation of weak base is suppressed. Again example of common ion effect. Now case 1. When we add when we add acid, for example HCl, so HCl is a strong acid, it gives H3O plus and Cl negative, HCl gives H plus ion to the solution, H3O plus ion increases in the solution, so pH should decrease but as H3O plus ions are added OH negative ion present in the buffer solution react with it means neutralize the effect of H3O plus means acid when we add base present in the solution neutralize it and therefore pH of the buffer solution will not change. Now case 2, when we add base, when we add base like NaOH, it give Na plus ion and OH negative ions. When OH negative ions increases in the solution, pH of the solution should increase. But when we add OH negative ion, NH4 plus ions present in the solution react with OH negative ions and we get NH4 OH. So equilibrium shifts backward and in this way effect of adding OH negative ion gets neutralized. So in this way we add acid or we add base. Their effect is counterbalanced, their effect is neutralized because of the reserve acidity or reserve basicity of the buffer solution.
OH negative ion is a reserve basicity of the buffer solution and NH4 plus ion is a reserve acidity of the solution. A buffer has a reserve acidity which it uses against a base. It has reserve basicity which it uses against an acid. So in this way you came to know the buffer action of acidic buffer as well as basic buffer. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you like this video, do press thumbs up button. Share my channel with your friends. God bless you all. Happy learning. Om Shanti.